Physiology of the eyes involves the complex processes that occur within the eye to allow us to see. Here is a breakdown of some of the key physiological processes that occur in the eyes. 1. Refraction The cornea and the lens of the eye work together to refract or bend light that enters the eye so that it can be focused on the retina. 2. Accommodation The ciliary body and the lens work together to adjust the shape of the lens, which changes the focal length of the eye and allows us to focus on objects at different distances. 3. Photoreception The retina contains photoreceptor cells called rods and cones, which detect light and send signals to the brain for interpretation. 4. Signal processing Once the photoreceptor cells detect light, they send signals to other cells in the retina, which process the signals and send them to the brain via the optic nerve. 5. Color vision The cones in the retina are responsible for color vision. There are three types of cones that respond to different wavelengths of light, which allows us to see different colors. 6. Dark Adaptation In low light conditions, the rods in the retina become more sensitive to light, which allows us to see better in the dark over time. 7. Light Adaptation When there is a sudden change in lighting conditions, the eyes adjust to the new lighting conditions by quickly adjusting the size of the pupil and reducing sensitivity of photoreceptor cells. 8. Eye Movements the muscles in the eyes work together to allow us to move our eyes up, down, sideways, and diagonally to scan our environment and focus on objects of interest. 9. Tear Production The eyes produce tears to lubricate and protect the surface of the eye. The tear film also helps to refract light and prevent dreariness. In summary, the physiology of the eyes involves the complex and coordinated interactions between many different structures and processes. Different physiological processes work together to allow us to see and interpret the world around us. The eye is a complex organ responsible for vision. It is made up of several structures that work together to allow light to enter the eye, form an image, and send signals to the brain for interpretation. Here is a breakdown of the major structures that make up the anatomy of the eye. 1. Cornea This is the clear, dome-shaped outer layer of the eye that covers the iris and the pupil. It is responsible for refracting and focusing light as it enters the eye. 2. Iris The colored part of the eye. The iris controls the size of the pupil and regulates the amount of light that enters the eye. 3. Pupil This is the black circular opening in the center of the eye that allows light to enter. 4. Lens This structure is situated behind the iris and the pupil and is responsible for fine-tuning the focus of light onto the retina. 5. Sclera this is the white outermost layer of the eye that provides protection and structure for the eye. 6. Retina The retina is a thin layer of tissue that lines the back of the eye. It contains photoreceptor cells called rods and cones that are responsible for detecting light and sending signals to the brain for interpretation. 7. Macula This is a small region within the retina that is responsible for central vision and high-resolution visual tasks. 8. Optic Nerve this is a bundle of nerve fibers that carry visual signals from the retina to the brain for interpretation. 9. Vitreous humor. This is a clear, gel-like substance that fills the space between the lens and the retina, providing structure and support to the eye. 10. Choroid. This is a layer of blood vessels that supplies nutrients and oxygen to the retina and other parts of the eye. 11. Ciliary body. This is a ring of muscle located behind the iris that controls the shape of the lens for focusing. 12. Conjunctiva This is a thin, transparent membrane that covers the sclera and lines the inside of the eyelids, providing protection and lubrication for the eye. Overall, the anatomy of the eye is complex and intricate, with each structure playing a vital role in the process of vision. If you have found this video useful, please click on the like button. Also, subscribe so as to get more useful videos that could help you in your eye care. Finally, place your comment below to let us know what topics you are interested in knowing about.